Popsicle Girl here, and today I'm going to share with you a short hair tutorial for bumper faux bangs. This is going to be a modern day pinup style, big, big pinup glam with short hair because we all know we want it even if we have a cute little pixie. It's not even bobbling. So let's get started. Hey guys, welcome back. My name is Popsicle Girl and I'm here to show you guys another short hair tutorial. Today we're going to do something called bumper bangs or otherwise known as faux bangs. As you can see I have kind of side swept bangs right now but we are going to turn these curlies under make them look like a modern day pinup. So to start with this look we only need a few things. Your straightener. I like to use a hair straightener on short hair because I just feel like it's a little bit easier to get in there. Just make sure that you keep it at a constant turn while we do that. You're also going to need a couple of boxes pins. These are going to dent your curl when it first comes off, sure that the heat escapes and you're able to hold the curl in place. You are also going to need a comb. I would recommend a backcombing comb, but you can also use a regular comb. This one just helps a little bit to smooth out everything. Lastly, you will need your favorite hard hold hairspray. I like to use the bedhead. This is my favorite. I think it works really well. Let's go ahead and dive in. Once you've gotten your flat iron up to heat, you are going to go ahead and take that whole front section if you have more hair go ahead and don't be afraid to take it in two sections just curl it exactly the same way and you are gonna take that at a complete 90 degree angle keep spinning keep spinning all right so we've got that shape there right you can already see we've kind of got what we want going on but it's definitely not large enough so go ahead turn your straightener off right now put it to the side all right so now that we have that shape that we like we are going to go ahead and pull it up a little bit if you have longer bangs go ahead and clip them but since you probably have short hair if you're watching this short hair tutorial you can kind of just push them in place and you can secure them with a little bobby pin let them get air live your best life you know, do your thing. You're already kind of seeing kind of where we're going here. Pull them off, give them a little spritz. Okay, now that we have let this cool, I went ahead and took out the little bobby pin. We are gonna split this in sections. So you are gonna take your comb, start in the back, and don't brush against the curl, keep the curl, but start to brush backwards. And don't like worry if some of the hair comes out of your hand, that's okay. The idea, it's going to look very messy at first. Just lightly back home. Alright, grab another section. Do the same thing. Back, comb back. And this is where you get to decide how much volume you want. Grab another section right here. And I'm starting to look really good, as you can tell. We'll grab a little bit more all the way to the front the front is going to be tucked under anyway so don't worry too much about that all right i think this is it i think this is good right no once you've gotten it to where you like it it's big enough the volume that you want it take your hairspray and generously spray all over but you can still see there's a little bit of curl we are going to lightly brush from front to back with that back coming brush. That original shape, once you get it as smooth as you like, just make sure you get all the pieces smooth so you can't see all of that teasing underneath. All right, so I'm going to take this, gently tuck it under. And I'm going to pull it very, very gently from the middle, out to the sides, as you can see, then I'm going to go ahead and hairspray while it's sitting here. 
Now this is where you get to decide what you want to do. I'm going to angle mine up, so I'm going to take a bobby pin on each side, very, very lightly pull, and place that bobby pin where you'd like it. Do the same thing on the other side. Bobby pin, make sure it is still curled underneath. I just pulled up just a little to that side. So once you have everything pinned up nicely, you can go back with your comb or the end of a pencil and just kind of make sure everything is pushed up nicely and then just very heavily just spray that hairspray. There you go. Bow bangs, bumper bangs with a modern day look and I love these little guys but I kind of think that we should put a little curl into them. Turn your flat iron back on. Make sure it's hot enough. Your hair will already have probably a little bit of hairspray from the front. So if you want to end up doing the rest of your hair, you'll have a little bit of hold already. So don't worry. Yay! Crazy. They kind of look like party ribbons now. Another trick to have your pig tiles stand up higher, take a little bobby pin, put it down at the base, and check this out. Seriously, it's insane. Your pigtails, like, immediately. Your ponytails, everything. They stick straight up. You can add whatever accessories you'd like. I'm gonna add some horns. <laughs> hey. Thank you guys for tuning in to another short hair tutorial with Popsicle Girl. I'm so excited to see you guys next week when I'll be launching a whole new series on brand history. Also, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the alarm button if you'd like to see brand new videos. They will be up soon. Whoa.